Hey everybody, it's Ryan. Welcome back to How Farms Work. Travis and I are about to head to the Bloomington Livestock Exchange where I'm hoping to buy about 20 head of cattle. Um, we'll just have to see what they're going for, um, whether they're going at a decent price or not. But we just finished hooking out the trailer and we're about to head out. Just left the sales barn. We got 21 head, averaged about 12.50 a piece, and uh, we were plan only planning on getting it at max 20. But um, to get up to 20, we had to bite the bull and get another one, which I'm fine with because our budget was 26,000, and it cost 26,350 dollars to buy them all. So we're waiting in line. We're gonna start hauling them out. We want to be done before the sun goes down, so we're kind of in a rush now. Well, I'm pretty sure Mother Nature knows when we're buying cattle, because every time we haul them, it rains. It's, it's a fact.
rain wasn't good enough for you now we've got sleet and now we have finally moved to snow So we're back at the farm. Unfortunately, we are not going to go back and get the other two loads tonight. We're gonna to wait until tomorrow. Um, when we were coming back, the road was pretty darn slippery and uh, I was sliding pretty good. So I don't really wanna take any more risks than we have to. So just gonna wait until tomorrow morning. We have to have them hauled out by noon tomorrow because that's when there will be people around to help us load them. We're back out of my place now. We called it quits for the night. Um, unfortunately, with the weather, uh, I didn't really feel comfortable going and picking up the cattle, which we think was the right call because we had checked the Facebook scanner page for the county and a pickup in a trailer had slid off the road on one of the routes that we take to go to the sales barn. So we think it was probably for the better that we didn't go. Um, I can just wait till tomorrow. If not, I, I really hope it gets better, <laughs> which it should. Uh, this is supposed to end around nine. We've literally had everything from rain to sleet to snow and then back to rain when it's gone back and forth like two or three times today. So I don't know. Let's just have a quick recap on everything that I bought. I bought 21 head of cattle and uh, their average weight was 1,234 pounds. Average dollars per head was 1,254. Average per hundred weight was 101.68. Uh, total weight was around 26,000 and the total amount was $26,350. So I bought, the first group was, were a group of heifers, there were seven of them. And um, I paid 1,200 a piece for those. And then the second group was six cows and I paid 1325 for those. And then the last group was eight cows and I paid 1250 for those. The heifers obviously haven't had their first calf yet. They're going to be calving this spring. Um, they are in their third trimester, all of them are. And um, the cows have already had at least one calf. And from the looks of them, they do look to be a little bit younger. They don't appear to be older, which the green tags could have ranged anywhere between like two and seven years old, I think. But um, I, overall, I'm, I'm pretty happy with what I ended up with. I think that I made out pretty good. Um, we just got to make sure that I, I got to keep an eye on them going into the spring here. Uh, make sure that the heifers are taking care of their calves and make sure that I'm not having any issues there. But uh, yeah, I think that's going to be about it for this video. Uh, since we're going to go pick the cows up tomorrow, um, when this video comes out, we're going to be hauling, hauling them back home. So <laughs> uh, I promised you guys that at least our Snapchat followers that I would post a video on this on Sunday tomorrow. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go and edit this now. So I might make a video on going and getting the rest of them. Um, maybe, I don't know, probably just because we still got to feed them bales and everything. And I want to have a closer look at them. I haven't really seen them other than what I did in the ring. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, be sure to ask. I'll try to respond to as many as I can. Um, with that, thanks for watching this video, guys. Be sure to check out all of our other ones. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat, all how farms work. And with that, I'll see you next time.